Okay, I want to come on here real quick. Spirit's been Spirit's been giving me a download. I don't want to forget it or nothing, so I'm gonna record it now. Okay, there is somebody that's like they're like, what the f? What the f? They're they're trying to figure out like what the f is going on? How come they're wondering how come their magic ain't working? This is someone that was accustomed to doing black magic, but Spirit was telling me. That was only a limited edition. It was like a limited edition. It just, it was a limited time only. The black magic ain't working. Like I said, those times that we're in now, it's impossible. If you're trying to do black magic over someone else's free will, it ain't gonna work. It ain't. Things are gonna start going back to normal. Yeah, someone's like, what the, what the F? Someone's just panicking. That's what I'm getting. Bad reputation. Wow. This could be a wolf in sheep's clothing. A wolf in sheep's clothing is trying to come out. I'm gonna pull another card. This came out for the Divine Masculines yesterday. So let me go ahead and pull another card, another energy. This could be someone that was trying to ruin your reputation. Dust it off. Dust it off. You're dusting it off. Oh yeah, the magic wore off. Yep, spirit says limited time only. The only, yeah. Wow. Yeah, the universe allowed the black magic to work over you for just a limited time only. Like everything they're trying, they're expecting it to just work just like that. And they're not seeing no results. It's actually getting, it's actually having the opposite effect. A lot of you guys are about to, if they was trying to ruin your reputation, or wanted you to have a bad reputation your your reputation is being fixed or something or you're having like a comeback or something like that old school yeah they're stuck in the past they got so accustomed there's a old little tape they got so accustomed. A lot of them was doing like uh, mental magic. They thought like their their mind was just, like they thought they could just think something. Like their mind was just so powerful over you. They could think something and then just have it just work over you just instantly. Like trying to do stuff over against your free will. Outdated thinking, outdated conditioning, replaying events over in their head yeah they're having nightmares they're having sleepless nights that's what i'm getting intuitively what i'm about to start doing spirit has been giving me a lot of downloads what i'm about to be doing now i'm about to start writing it down about to start writing it down bringing the journal in here in my office and putting up right it right here mm-hmm Yeah. Somebody in this energy is like screaming and stuff. They're in despair and stuff. Yeah, they're scared. They're like, why this magic ain't working? Yeah, thoughts. Look, they're all up in their head. Thoughts. Outdated thinking. They was trying to control your guys' mind, your thoughts. Trying to play with your mental health. Isolating. You could be isolating yourself away from whoever this is. They see you got the power. You're doing magic over your own life. You're manifesting with your free will on your own life only. You're not trying to force nobody to do nothing against their free will. You ain't trying to do spell work over nobody. You ain't doing none of that. You, you don't even need to do none of that. I'm 
show us more with this energy. Two of Swords. Okay, they could have wanted you confused, blindfolded. They're trying to interfere with your thinking. They want you confused, blindfolded. Eight of Cups. Yeah, it's the end of some kind of phase. The, the, um, Hmm. Yeah. The magic wore off. It's the end of spirits telling me something about like it's the end of some kind of energy. They could have been doing energy manipulation. You may have walked away from this person or people. They're just stuck in a cycle trying to do black magic over you over and over and over again. I'm getting yeah they're upset have an outburst they're having emotional outbursts and stuff some of you guys are hearing their um their you're hearing them intuitively like I said you could be picking up on like their psyche their thoughts reading their mind the universe could be like letting you know what these people are thinking and stuff when it comes to you to to protect you if they try to harm you or something yeah somebody is having an emotional outburst because they wanted to ruin your reputation dust it off it's 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 fade it's fade enough it's it wore off the magic wore off yeah two of pentacles something's balancing out now some of you guys are feeling like you're balancing out emotionally Page of Pentacles. There's new, fresh energy here. You're learning something. The universe is allowing you to be in tune with something, with whoever this is, to teach you something. There's some new growth. Five of Cups, yeah. They're in despair, sorrow. Could be grieving, depressed. It's played out. It's played out. What they're trying to do is just played out. They could have been trying to block you guys. None of that stuff is working. Yeah, someone is someone's mad, they're angry, frustrated. They feel like they have no power over you. They feel completely powerless. They're like, what the heck? the moon yeah they're doing stuff behind the scenes yeah the moon page of cups a lot of you guys like i said are are picking stuff up up, up intuitively hearing them intuitively what they're trying to hide from you you're clearly hearing it or seeing it sensing it seeing it in your dreams possibly it's your intuition Someone's having insomnia. Page of Wands. Yeah, look at all these pages. Almost all the pages are here. Yeah, I feel like you guys are getting like um, intuitive messages or something. Page of Wands. This could be a message of good news. Something something someone's getting ready to do, some plans. But yeah, they're having sleepless nights. Nine of Swords. You're happy and stuff because you you know something's balancing out for you. Whoever this is wanted to they trying to project like their psyche off onto you or something. They want you to feel like, like you're crazy or something. King of Swords. Yeah, someone knows something. You know something. Um, you could be hearing something. 
seeing something you may be cold it seems like you're cold from whoever this person or people is cold distant reserved and maybe you're isolating yourself away from them to me all this could be some young people with these all these pages What else? Yeah, living room. See, there's a sorrow. Something about a living room. Number 21. The cycle's over. Could be someone in the living room. prison yeah it's like now they're in a mental prison now they're in like a mental cage or something this could be someone literally in prison or literally in jail i feel like they wanted you in like a a mental prison or something like that or some of y'all they did want you in jail take the living room energy where it resonates Whoever resonates with that, they're feeling um, like the Eight of Swords, like trapped, trapped, stuck, mentally stuck. It's interesting because a lot of you guys who are picking this stuff up intuitively too, they, they don't know that you guys are hearing them. They don't know you're hearing their thoughts and stuff and their psyche and all that. What else? Leo. Okay, yeah, they see you in this confident energy. It's something with your self-confidence is triggering them. Self-confidence, taking, taking a chance on, resulting from the impressiveness of leadership, the creativeness of do what you want to and Yeah, they feel like you have all the power. Bluff. You could have caught someone bluffing. Jupiter and Gemini. Yeah, it's something like uh, Gemini energies like communication, stuff you hear, stuff you read. Maybe documents, paperwork. Oh, Jupiter is actually in Gemini right now for the collective. This person's blindfolded here too. Blindfold on this person's eyes. Blindfold on their eyes right there. The moon. Yeah, someone wants you blindfolded, confused. Okay, something with romance. Venus and Taurus could be something with love, romance. Yeah, especially with this Leo energy. Leo and Taurus is about um, romance, love, creativity. This could be some new love with the Page of Cups, Page of Wands, Page of Pentacles. It could be a new love commitment about to happen. A, ro a new romantic commitment about to happen. This may be someone that doesn't want you to leave them behind or walk away. Yeah, they're trying so hard to uh, do. Uh, this could be mental magic. They're trying so hard to do black magic over you. Yeah, they're restless. Like I said, I'm sensing like they're up at night, restless, insomnia. Mercury and Aries. Yeah, someone's thinking about doing something. It's like something with this old school with this this tape. 
it's like you you've been dealing with this for so long or it's just you've been hearing something for so long going through for something so long they keep doing the same thing over and over it's just played out so it's like you know it's them they don't they don't understand just how much they're they are exposed that's what i'm getting what else spirit says expect miracles you could be dealing with someone selfish you're possibly dealing with a narcissist trust that all will unfold in divine timing you are one with divine will yeah you hold all the power over your life and like your manifestations your creations your creativity like i keep telling you guys nobody a lot of you guys are learning and realizing nobody has power to do black magic over you or spell work or whatever yeah or mental magic whatever you're about to blow everyone away dang someone's about to blow everyone away oh it could be something with your reputation because what came out is bad reputation your reputation is about to change for the better honey some of y'all this is new money new money new jobs more money increases raises something exciting new uh, new creative projects could be something artistic definitely something with romance or new love okay God says God says I'm going to amaze you with my goodness mm-hmm Oh, nothing but good stuff all this is good stuff coming out for you some of you guys if you've been isolating or something like that or if uh, the universe like set things up so you have to be isolated especially with Saturn and Pisces that's like time for a lot of people to be in isolation 12th house Pisces is about isolation the universe did that on purpose so you could get woke to certain stuff what was going on behind the scenes something within the next few months see listen to your intuition that's that's what the universe wants you to do keep listening to your intuition you're picking stuff up intuitively trust that you know you're not crazy don't feel like you're crazy don't feel like you're going crazy or nothing like that that's god is trying to show you something trying to show you what these people are thinking your enemies are thinking Okay, let's get a final message. So something within the next few months. That could be some amazing things coming. Miracles coming within the next few months. Okay, final message. yeah they thought they was gonna block your miracles yeah see two of air they keep trying to interfere yeah top of the deck emperor you have the power three of water 
Yeah. They want to, um, they've been trying to interfere in your thinking, your thoughts, your, um, something they've been doing behind the scenes. This two of swords is out again. They definitely want you confused or to create blockages, blindfold you. Being unable or unwilling to make a decision. A stalemate. Pretending there is no problem. Somebody may be trying to block you from uh, walking away with Eight of Cups, Two of Swords, or trying to um, have you confused or indecisive about leaving them behind. Yeah. That's it. I just wanted to come out here because that's what Spirit was telling me. These people on Karmic Energy, they're like, what the F? Why this magic ain't working no more? It was it was working before. What happened? Spirit says it was a limited edition only. 